Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. First, I wanna say thank you to all my new subscribers. I truly appreciate it. And it's very comforting to me to know that there are people out there that has the same passion that I have for planning. It's great, thank you. Today, I am doing a video about my A6 Campania in the color Undyed. It's so cute. From the time I opened this, the box for this planner, it was love. So much so that I abandoned my personal size unicorn, which is the Amica in the dark brown. Now, if they're doing construction in my building. If, if the noise gets too much, I may not upload it if it sounds too crazy. But, you know, sorry about that. You know. But... Like I was saying, my A6, this is the first time I'm trying A6 in rings. I do have an A6 notebook in the uh, Stalogy, but I've never had the rings. Wow. It is so cute and compact. I don't know. I don't know if it's because it's the square shape. Something about it, it just works for me. Like this is the closest thing I've come to to plan a piece. Um, so let's go ahead. Now, I, I didn't set this up completely yet. I still have a lot. I'm waiting for some dividers. So in the meantime, I'm using these tab from Amazon. These are the Avery brand. And I also have some bow tabs here from Josephine Bow Designs that I'm using to separate a few things. Um, I'm going to start with the charms. As you know, this is from Kubo and Lucy. All my charms are basically from, ooh, from Kubo and Lucy. Just that here. And now the fact that this planner is so cute to me, it's making my style of planning a little different. Like with this, I want to really, you know, use cute things, just cutesy accessories you know more playful i feel like with the uh to me the personal size is more gives me like a more mature vibe um more serious but i feel like i can like you know play around more with the a6 and i love it so here we have in my pockets, we have freebie here from Planning With B in case of emergency from Planning With B. And these are from Tool & Twine. This is from Sparkly Paper, Paper Co. I have Ollie clip here from the Ollie Block. This is a piece of ribbon that I purchased from Michaels. It comes like this. I just cut it, stuck it in a pocket. This is, uh, this is the brand, Celebrate It. That's from Michaels. They had different, they had an array of, you know, different um, ribbons there. Some vellum here from Josephine Bow Designs. I have a freebie from her as well. And some freebies from Sterling Inc. So again, this is not completed quite yet. My word of the year is aesthetic. So I found this very fitting for my front cover. This is from Plain, Plain and Chic, Plain and Chic Designs. She has an awesome shop as well on Etsy. These are journaling cards from Tool and Twine. And uh, this right here is from Caspresso. These are freebies from Planning with B. We have the EO Edits freebie vellum here. I have this pin together because I don't like how this fits. This is A6 size from uh, Tool and Twine, but it's not really sizing well in my planner. I see some people talk about true A6 and things like that. I don't know if that's the case. Um, I'm going to take it out though, but these are some um, sticky notes from Cloth and Paper, and I went ahead and printed out Paper Test Designs an alo um you know design we have inbox section now with my inbox i have a few different inboxes i couldn't choose so this one is from eo edits 
I'm also trying out planning with be coded inbox. Um, if you can see here, you have the inbox key, then you color code what's urgent and what's not. I still haven't color coded the rest, but I like it. It's a good concept. Um, these are all the same. Sterling ink, vellum. We have planning with B. Now this right here, this is gonna follow me in every planner forever. This is from the Tua Notes. I love it. It is just practical, functional, just simple, and it's, it looks good. So um, you have the to do, you have to buy, and you have memo, and it gives you ample space to fill it in. And also you have the call, you know, to call, email, and stuff like that. So it works out well for me. I love it. This is a spoke to log from Planning with B. These are some um, design paper from the Tua Notes. You know, I just have to jot stuff down. I like to have extra paper in my planner for quick notes. This is from Coffee Monsters Co. Some freebie paper. You have my calendar section. I got this holiday list from Planning with B. Now, at first, if I can show you what I was using at first. When I first jumped in this planner, I was... Um, using different inserts and why it didn't work out so this is from um doa designs and um the boxes just wasn't working for me the, it, it was too small and i have this um bundle this is the paper test designs collab with alo bundle it comes with everything you need it's about 13 bucks comes with the monthly the weekly daily and some uh, sticky notes so i like you know the larger scale here like you know the front even though the boxes are almost you know the same i just feel like it gives you more space here under here gives you you know some space for tracking or you know lists but i just like this whole layout right here so i went ahead with uh paper tests instead it's just a cleaner look for me so as you know i just jumped in here this month so january and february is kind of a dub um march this is the march section so i have all the months in here i believe up until august i have my uh vacation time already highlighted out see little airplanes i can't wait getting out of here <laughs> so this is a dashboard from petty patty sorry from sparkly paper co of petty patty <laughs> and also a piece of vellum from them as well more uh vellum from sparkly paper co just a list sticky note again from um paper test designs this is my son, my husband and I. I have some um, notes from Simply Gilded. Oh, and also this bow is from Simply Gilded as well. And I put some more of that ribbon here just so when you close it, it have that kind of, you know, you know what I try to do. Um, this is a weekly section. This right here is from EO Edits. This cute, this is so cute. I love this vellum. This is from um, Josephine Bowes Designs. I can't remember where I got this fluffy little clip from. I have to check my uh, Etsy records. So yes, this is the weekly overview section. So for this week, I tried a little thing. Here I tried to track my mood. I don't know if I'm gonna continue that because I'm really moody. <laughs> So I wasn't e even able to, I don't feel like it's going to work for me. I feel like my mood changes too often for the most part. Down here, I tried uh, some tracking, multivitamins, eight glasses of water, 50 squats, and one hour of study. As you can see, I took vitamins on Saturday, and that was all she wrote. But either way, I like this layout. I love it. It, it, it works for me. So. so that's the weekly section. 
we have another piece of vellum here this is from um sparkly paper co as well freebie from coffee monsters co and this is a content uh insert i can't quite remember the shop i wish she would have had it on the paper but it's a great shop very affordable here i try to plan out my content and you know things like that so that's just a small section for that um some vellum here from josephine bow actually i'm sorry this is from sparkly paper co daily section freebie from gracie edits um, I cut this a little too small, so I'm going to have to change that. EO Edits Freebie Aesthetic Board. Then we have the dailies. So, so far I got, uh, is this today? This might be today. Let's see. Then we go into my finance section. Now, I love this bundle. Um, I would do most of my finances in my hobo weeks. But since I moved over to my new Hobo Weeks, I told myself I was going to transfer all of that. But then I was like, I kind of want things already written out for me instead of me drawing all the charts and doing all that by myself. So when I saw this bundle, I was like, yes, you know, this is the finance section. Here I have some, um, I'll show you guys. I'm not ashamed. Okay, you can see. We'll go through it. Um, here I have some um, keeping track of PayPal payments. Shop pay payments. Just check off once they take their money out. I love this bill section. Um, you have a monthly bill section for all your like maybe fixed monthly bills. I wish I didn't put my light and gas in there because that's always different. But get the drift here. We have annual bill section. I pay Amazon Prime yearly. That's like one nineteen a year. Then we have um, section for. Your credit cards, you put your credit cards there. I made myself my own legend. This red dot is like if I was a day late in payment, which I hate. Sometimes, you know, time get away from me and I look up and I'm like, oh gosh, you know. But this is uh my debt section. Uh, same thing, you write out the creditor, total debts, and then it breaks it down for you as you pay it off. So I like that a lot. Um, I just wish she made these sheets right here, like a single page where you can um, print some more. So what I had to do is print these single sided and I glued two sheets together like that to make it, you know, back in front. Because if I didn't, then it would have kept printing out this front page here, debt payments, you know. So I had to get real crafty on it. <laughs> um what else we got she also includes a savings section savings tracker we have well this is the budget section again must have printed it twice then we have a spending tracker as you can see i already started my nonsense i'm freaking <laughs> um these are the dividers i ordered from Lines plus paper, and I also ordered some page lifters from off the BST group. And you have a space for expenses. Just some sticky notes again from Paper Test Designs. And I always try to make it a I always try to make a self-care section in my planners because it's really, sometimes you can neglect yourself just by going day by day and not taking the time to love on yourself, you know? So I try to have little reminders like this in this section, things I can work through, you know, when I'm feeling anxiety or stress. So this is a freebie from EO Edits. I love this image. I found this image on Pinterest. Transferred it onto Canva, resized it, and popped it in here. I think this is the vibe that, you know, I strive for. Just chilling. Um, this is an insert from DOAA. And this was... I, I found this through Allo. Um, I think it's a collab. 
So I uh, started off, but I have to work through the, the chart. So I'm gonna work on that later on today. I have my list section. Again, these dashboards from Tour Twine. This is a dashboard I made on my own. I just was in love with these um, llama pictures. I got that paper from uh, Michael's Pop 2 um, adhesive pockets on it and just decorated it. Something fun. These are my baby girls. Um, I have a seasonal reset here from EO Edits. And these are mostly lists. These are from uh, Planning With B. These are all freebies, brain dump, subscription, add to planner, the last time. I think this is clever because sometimes you forget the last time you did something. You know, last time you got an oil change, the last time you scrubbed the tub, last time you changed out, you know, the filter on the coffee machine <laughs> things like that so i like it it's definitely gonna come in handy i have my weight log here so as you can see it have date weight change from last difference from the start and it have details here i put butt naked because that's how i took my weight at that on that day <laughs> um to order log here we go this is where my problems stem from <laughs> Oh gosh, but these are mostly planner goods and things like that. I like to keep track because sometimes I forget that I order something and I do that mostly in Cat Espresso Co. I'm always ordering by mistake double the uh these vellum folder things. I don't know why. But yes, I like to keep track of that. Project and events that is from planning with B again more scratch paper from cat from uh, coffee monsters co and here we have some design paper from um the two of notes but i made it into my wish list and i have a school insert that i'm going to fill out for my kids i think i'm gonna put that picture here so then it'd be like school so yeah this is a um bookmark from Sh planet char it's gorgeous I wish it was a little smaller, but I love this. I have my um, Starbucks gift card here. And a freebie from Sterling Inc. Just some extra stickers. We have a Good Vibes Only card from Planet With B. Memo paper from uh, Cafe Cloth and Paper. <laughs> Dream Big, Act Small. Ugh, start Small, Act Now. This is from Infinite Lotus. And who else we got? Oh, there's some sticky note from Cloth and Paper. And this is a card I received with my purchase from Faded Chronicle. And of course, I got my Vanishing Point Medium Nib Pilot Pen. My favorite and only, no, this is not my only fountain pen. I have a starter fountain pen. Did I have to show you guys this fountain pen? If I, can, if I have it nearby. This is a fountain pen for beginners. I know it's off topic, but this is a Kakuno. Um, I'm going to do a video about Planner Essentials, and I'm going to probably go more into the detail about this. But if you're now starting into the fountain pen life, I suggest this. This is... I want to say it writes better than my Pilot, but... And it's affordable. I think this was like $12 or less. Anywho, so that is the flip of my A6. Um, yeah, guys, I love her so much. Like, I keep changing, like evolving. Now I'm starting to like look at um travelers notebooks but that's what this whole thing is about right it's like a journey so i'm just having fun enjoying the process and i'm just going where it takes me but right now i feel really good in this a6 size i love everything about it um i feel like i'm gonna be in here a while yes with the size it limits me with the amount of sections and things i can have in here 
But if that's the case, I always have my personal wide to back me up. So I understand now why people have extension planners because sometimes the size you love, it may not be able to hold your whole life in it. Although I'm going to try. You have an extension reference planner. So I get it now. Um, so that's pretty much it. Um, thank you guys for tuning in. Again, this is um, A6 Campania Undive from Giglio. Anything that you have questions, you know, if you have any questions, just leave it down below and I'll try to get back to everyone. So thank you and have a good day. Bye. Hey guys, as soon as I finish filming that part, I received a little knock on the door. So I just wanted to unbox these goodies with you. Um, let's start off with this one. This is from uh, With Love, Jomel. And I believe that this is my bookmarks that I ordered from her. So let's go ahead and take a look. Oh, Lord. I'm horrible. These boxes. Actually, let me see. So yeah, I ordered some bookmarks. It's a new shop. Never really just ran across her shop and... I like how the bookmarks look. So, packaging. Oh, I got some marker on my hand from uh, scratching out my address. Hopefully, I don't get any transfer onto anything. So, it's packaged really cute. Look at these cute little bookmarks, guys. Oh, man. I ordered three. That's nice, right? I love me some uh, ribbon. I like to see ribbon sticking out of the planners. I think that is absolutely gorgeous. And it comes with some, uh, you know, crafty tissue paper there. And we have a card from her, Jomel, journal Instagram. And she's at, at with love Jomel. So that is that with a nice little thank you card in here. So wow, I really like that a lot. Next, this is for this uh will be for my A6 astrology for my fun planner. I'm still working on it. I'm having fun with it, sticking in all type of colorful stuff. So this is from Shine Sticker Studio. Ooh. This is how it comes packaged with my name. I wish I could save this, but I'm not that good. <laughs> my name on it. Okay, let's see what we got. Water some washi. So, these are some washi, some colorful washi, it's cute, I ordered some sticky notes, some posted sticky notes, and what else do we got? Shipping was pretty fast, it took about four days. I'm, I'm like half and half i love this colorful it's either this colorful playful vibe or i like florals and more you know uh i got some to do stickers i got a note to self sticker you just paste it on let's see let's try a page should be able to fit directly on there boom look at that perfect fit of course, I'm going to round the corners, and they'll be perfect in there. Um, this is a freebie sticker sheet, a card. I love this one. I've seen it. Self-Love Club. Again, be trying to make that top priority this year and onward. We have Llama Love. I told you how I feel about llamas, right? <laughs> I have some uh, weekday stickers. 
dental appointment stickers. And I got this because, you know, I'm doing the Invisalign thing. It's not going that well because I don't have the discipline to keep it in all day. Um, These are some headers, cute bows. And some more paper to stick onto the sheet. And I could just write what I have to write on there. So that's just a small order from her. I love it. Happy with everything. Just wanted to show you guys. But this right here. These are cute. These are really, really cute. I'm going to just stick one in here. See how that looks? I like that. Okay, so now is the end of my video. <laughs> so thank you guys for tuning in. Bye. <laughs>